Hello everyone, this video is going to be a tutorial inspired by Makeup by Rin Rin. She did a look like this using Sugar Pill Cosmetics. I'm going to do the same similar look using MAC Cosmetics and I'm using products from the new Dare to Wear collection. So, just stay tuned. First, I took the next Jumbo eyeshadow pencil in milk. I applied it all over my lid up to my brow and underneath my lower lash line. The first color I'm going to take on my lid is my Sassy Grass, which is a bright grass green, like the um, description. And I'm going to use the Sigma 239. I'm going to pack this on my lid. And it's going to take a lot of packing, so get ready. Next one I'm going to do is take that bright purple from the collection, which is called Shockaholic, and it's also matte. I'm going to take a Kirkland crease brush and pull out this on my outer crease. And this is also going to take packing. In the inner half of my crease, I'm going to take a MAC 2782 and the blue from the collection, which is called Zingy. And I must say that this is one of my favorite shades from the collection. One of the limited edition shades. I'm just going to take and apply that in my inner crease. I'm going to go in with that purple again and bring it a bit higher. Now what you want to do is take your highlight color. This is my rice paper and I'm using a 227. I'm going to apply this underneath my brow and blend downwards. But before I continue blending downwards, I'm going to go ahead and take my Shockaholic again and that same blender brush. I'm going to take just a bit, just a little bit on the tip of the brush and I'm going to help use this to help blend out that harsh edge. I'm going to do the same thing using that Zingy, which is the um, blue that's in my inner corner. And I'm going to use the same brush, do the same thing. To help, you can also take that rice paper and apply some on the tip of your brush and bring it on the outer edge. I'm just going to go back and apply the colors back and forth to make sure both eyes are the same and to make sure the colors are as blended as I can possibly make them. Next, I'm going to move on to my lower lash line. I'm going to apply sassy grass in the middle and then I'm going to take that shockaholic and apply on my inner and outer corners. I'm going to diffuse the two together. Now I'm done with my eyeshadow. Feel free to clean up the outer edges. Next, I'm going to take Smolder Eye Cold and line my waterline and also a tight line. Then I'm gonna take my Wet n Wild H2O proof liquid liner in black. Then I'm gonna take my L'Oreal telescopic mascara in black is black. And lastly I'm gonna apply my 102 Ardell Demi Lashes and I'll return to show you what I use for the remainder of my face. While I'm waiting on the glue on my eyelashes to dry, I'm gonna go ahead and apply my concealer. I'm gonna use Mac Select Moisture Cover in NC45. You can apply foundation if you'd like, but I'm going to skip that this time. For my lips, I'm going to apply Wet n Wild's lipstick in 907C, which is a, like a medium fuchsia color. If you don't know anything about Wet n Wild lipsticks, 
well at least this formula I'm not sure what formula it is because it doesn't say but they can be very drying so I recommend wearing a lip balm underneath blotting it out then applying a lipstick on top to prevent the little yucky crustaceous looking skin on your lips for my lip gloss on top I'm gonna apply the new dare to wear lip gloss in gimme that which is a brighter fuchsia and I think this will really complement this lip color so I'm gonna apply that forgot about my cheeks. For my cheeks I'm going to take a pink blush. This is MAC Start Naked Beauty Powder Blush. I'm going to use a MAC 129 brush and put it on my cheeks. That's the look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. These are the eyes once more. And the cheeks and the lips. Please write, comment, and subscribe. Check out my blog for more pictures and information. And make sure you check out my Dare to Wear haul slash review. Because I will be discussing how I felt about the collection and all of that. So make sure you check that out. That should go up before this video. So it should already be on my channel. And you can just click the back button or click my name to be directed straight to my channel. So yeah, thanks for watching. Hey everyone, this video is going to be my dare to well, whoa, that's definitely not how you say the collection name.